Hi, I'm Dawn Masler. Welcome to episode 19 in Love School. As you know, I invite your questions on this blog. The other day, I had a gentleman write to me and ask me, is there any scientific validity in the statement that gentlemen prefer blondes? My first thought as a blonde was, yeah, but as a researcher, I'm supposed to remain objective. I'm supposed to investigate without prejudice. I have to admit, I've always been a little bit biased. I've always felt that if there was a competition between a blonde and a brunette, the blonde would win out. Of course, that was before Brad Pitt dumped dinner for Aniston for Angelina Jolie. So the question is, do gentlemen really prefer blondes? Well, it turns out they might. It's not about the hair color so much as the origins of the word gentleman. It turns out the word gentleman originated from the Scandinavian aristocracies. Understanding that makes the phrase gentlemen prefer blondes make more sense biologically. But it's not necessarily the hair color, but the light skin that typically goes with the blonde hair that may have been created the preference. Evolutionarily speaking, men are naturally attracted to traits that indicate good health and reproductive ability. Things like clear skin, rosy cheeks, and wide hips all indicate that a woman is reproductively healthy. Light skin is also historically an indicator that a woman is likely to have a healthy child in northern countries. In cool climates like Scandinavia, exposure to sunlight is limited. The body synthesizes vitamin D from sunlight, which helps to absorb calcium. Of course, calcium is needed to produce healthy children, and women need more calcium during pregnancy and lactation. Skin pigmentation can interfere with vitamin D synthesis. Therefore, Scandinavian women with lighter hair and skin have a biological advantage. Of course, today we can get our vitamins through supplements, so making the need for lighter skin or hair unimportant. In fact, 200 years ago, lighter skin was a sign of health and wealth. But since then, it has changed. Today, darker tanner skin is an indicator of health and wealth. So do gentlemen still prefer blondes? Maybe if he's ancient Danish royalty, but thick hair and skin color can go in and out of fashion. If you really want to attract someone, it's better to focus on things that don't go out of style, like indicators of good health. Things like eating right, exercising, and a bright smile are always preferred by gentlemen. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Love School, and I would love to chat with you. Please friend me on Facebook or leave a comment on my YouTube channel. Your feedback is important. And please let me know if there's anything you'd like to see in future episodes. Thanks. See you next week.